Hello, I'm Brian May, Director of Customer Solutions at Profound Logic Software. In this video, we're going to take a look at how to test API in Profound API. So to take a look at testing in Profound API, we're going to use the same API file that we created in our database API in four clicks video. So as you can see, I have my customer.api.json file open. So we have all of our API routes and we'll just choose one we'd like to test. Just to keep things simple, um, let's start out by testing the get list. So to test in Profound API, all we need to do is go over here to the test tab. The te there's testing capability already built into the IDE. You don't need any additional tooling in order to test. So if we take a look, you can see all of the input parameters that are defined for this API are listed right here in our test tab. Of course, all the parameters for this API are optional, so I'm not gonna bother filling any of them in. I'm just gonna scroll down and click Execute. And that's going to go out and call our API and retrieve a list of all the customers in our customer table. You can have a look here. Our response was a 200, which is a success in, in HTTP. And you can see our response body where we received our JSON with all of our data in it. Now, if we take a look at our get API here, get one is what it's called. Um, and we want to just retrieve one individual customer. Um, we can come here and just type in our customer number for our parameter. As you can see, it is required for this API. And we'll look for customer number 12. And we'll execute. That will go out and test this individual API. And we can see here that it retrieved the data just for customer number 12. You'll also notice that under the responses section, there are also commands that you could use to test this, uh, this API using something like curl, or you can actually retrieve the URL. So I can actually copy this URL and just drop it into a browser tab. And you'll see here that it will run just fine within our browser tab so that we can test that way. Another thing that we can look at when we're testing is we can go to the stats tab here in the IDE. Here we will see some metrics that will let us know how this API is performing and we can see if there are, for example, were any errors. I actually ran this and caused an error earlier so that we could actually see this data. We can take a look at handle times and how many successes, how many errors, average payload size, Lots of information that will let us know how this API is performing before we get ready to move it into our production environment. Thanks for watching our video, and I hope you're enjoying Profound API.